I have the great pleasure now of being joined by Dr. Desmond Schatz, ADA, President, Medicine and Science. Thank you so much for being here. I know you have such a great passion about this, but truly you want people to look at diabetes in a completely new way. Absolutely. I think uh, we all have a passion about diabetes. We're inspired by our patients, we're inspired by our colleagues. We want to make a difference in the lives of patients. In fact, the mission of the American Diabetes Association is truly to uh, improve the lives uh, of all patients with diabetes until which time we find a cure and we're able to prevent this disease. But I know you want people to look at it now in a little more urgent way. Yeah, so I am actually going to talk about this during my presidential address and the title of my talk is Diabetes a 212 Disease Confronting an Invisible Disease. And there are really two uh, parts that I want to cover. One is 212 degrees. What does 212 degrees mean to you? 212 degrees Fahrenheit is that point at which water boils. Water gets that sense of urgency. Water erupts and water erupts and creates movement and energy and energy powers generators and generators power movements. And movements have what has taken other diseases such as AIDS and hopefully Zika virus and others to new levels. Why are we not doing this for diabetes? I want for us to create that sense of urgency. We need to get to boiling point to drive change. For whatever reason, we think about diabetes and diabetes remains an invisible disease. It, well, it's certainly visible to the in individual and maybe around the patients, but really it's not visible to society. It is not visible to the government. It is really in some times not visible to the provider. There are still people dying of diabetes. People don't know about the burden of the disease. I mean, if we think about just the overall burden in the United States, currently it affects 30 million Americans and 8 million people don't even know that they have it. Worldwide, over 415 million people have diabetes. And do you know what? 46% of the people, even higher in Africa, don't know that they have diabetes. And yet, where is the urgency? Where is the government's sense of urgency? Where is our sense of urgency to try and tackle this, what I would say is escalating epidemic of diabetes. So what is your call to action to the attendees? You've got 16,000 or so people who are here all coming together believing that they want to make a difference. What do you want them to do when they go back home from this meeting? What they need to examine and ask themselves, are we working hard enough? Are we doing what we can each and every day to affect the lives? Yes, we go and we take care of our patients and yes, we try and make a difference, but are we doing enough? Do we need to get out? Do we need to go to Washington? Do we need to increase our advocacy? Do we need to demand that the government provide um, more funding for research? Why? When we look at the major um, advances, biomedical scientific advances of the last century, where is the prevention and cure of diabetes? Why have we allowed diabetes to be off that list when we think of some of the major advances. I mean, and we look at the more current advances such as HIV AIDS, I think that's one of the most significant advances of the 21st century where people with AIDS, HIV, can now live normal lives with, the, um, with taking more drugs and those drugs being available. And yet, they, not in any way to, to, to downcast the age movement, but there are so much fewer people who have AIDS. And look at how many people have diabetes. The money that is spent on AIDS, the reaction of the government to AIDS versus diabetes is very different. We need to advocate for more funding. We need to advocate for better reimbursement. We need to really you know, put on our hats, think outside the box and ask the question, are we getting closer? to the prevention and cure of diabetes. Well said, you are going to start a movement, let's hope. Thank you so much, Doctor.